about the San Siro. My name is Derek Ray, and I'm joined for commentary by the former Arsenal and West Ham player Stuart Robson. And tonight we've got the semi-final of the Champions League coming up for you. It's Inter against Atletico Madrid. Well, Derek, it could be cagey and it could be tight, but we've got some of the best players on view here, and they'll want to show just how good they really are. I can't wait for this tie to start. And a look at the Inter team. Jan Zoma is the goalkeeper. Alessandro Bastoni plays with Francesco Acerbi in central defence. Nicolo Barrella plays with Henrik Mkhitaryan in the centre of midfield. And leading the attack today, Lautaro Martinez plays alongside Marcus Turan. He could pick out a teammate. They do pass the ball with authority. Wonderful chance! And a goal! The A good challenge to bring that attack to an end. It's a good inter move in the making. Turan. On to Chavanolu. And a clear foul, but the referee letting the play flow. Looking for a teammate. It's with Saul. Griezmann. Saul. Koke. Llorente. And space to cross it. Morata. On to Koke. The chance to get them on top. Keeper. Well, a top-class reaction from a top-class goalkeeper. Brilliant stuff. Griezmann tasked with taking the corner. Smuggled away. Marcos Llorente. And decent passing sequences, but they need a leveler. <laughs> the referee has decided to give the free kick to Atletico. from the flank into the area just the clearance that was called for now they have possession in a good area of the pitch Griezmann and there we have it the first half comes to an end here at the San Siro most fans would be pretty happy with this man's display so far well, I really liked his first half display. He was certainly the most influential player on the field. And I'm expecting more of the same in the second 45 minutes. So on they go. The second half underway. And Atletico with a bit of work to do. get the free-kick decision their way well just a rebuke 
rather than a caution, Stuart. Well, it's not a bad tackle, and the referee's got that right. And here's a change now for Atletico. So did I, but in the end it comes to nothing. But what a great strike it was. It was hit so sweetly. Not great distribution from the keeper. Hermoso. Looking for that final pass and for that chance to level the game. Well, I think a classic commentator's curse just then. Couldn't make the ideal pass. Griezmann. Very well, based on that challenge, you wouldn't be at all surprised if the referee reaches for his pocket. And yellow it is. A booking? Yeah, he was too impatient to win the ball and probably deserved a yellow card. And he couldn't quite get himself back on side, Stuart. Well, as a player, you need to be able to change your mind. But he wasn't able to, and that's a poor pass. Fatesi. Now with Turan. Making use of his physical strength to hang on to it. Mkhitaryan trying to up and up the defence and it's gone in just what the doctor ordered things looking very bright for the man with this buffer well here's the replay it shows great awareness to play this through ball and then the finish is fairly simple in the end that's a good goal Back to the drawing board, I'm afraid. His team have been really poor today. So back underway. With the scoreline standing at 2-0. Barraza. The bye. It's with Hermoso. And he stopped them in their tracks. The referee has decided to give the free kick to Atletico. And time for the change now. And he whips it in. Well, they had a decent reading of that ball in. Can he get one back? He can! He's given his team a real opportunity. And momentum is with them. goal again and it's a really nice ball to put him through the vision to set up the chance is outstanding and then the perfect finish from Correa he really does hit this with power that's an excellent goal so the action continues can Atletico push for a leveler here Di Marco the ball with Martinez Mkhitaryan Moving forward effectively. 
but a good piece of defending to bring it to an end. Atletico Madrid know they're not going to get too many more chances. Time is a factor. Not all that convincing defensively. Depay. Depaul. Shepard to shoot. He's blocked it. Llorente. Ball retention so important. Well, just the tackle that was needed. And Morata's in the vicinity. Well, he gave it quite the whack, but not on target. Time for a change there. Llorente and the pie on the ball the final whistle there a second leg to come but Inter with the lead after this first match well they'll be pleased with that victory but it's a slender lead they're taking into the second leg and I think they'll be confident but it's going to be tight that's for sure